Um, I don't know where you are. You haven't been answering my calls or calling me back, which is not really like you. Hopefully you call me back before you hear this message. But I just wanted to let you know that Baba was gone. I'm really sorry, Jake. I, um, I know how much he meant to you. You know, he was always a good stepdad. He's been there for you and he taught you a lot. I've been praying for him. I said another prayer for him and his soul. May he rest in peace. I don't know if you want to say a prayer or talk to him or whatever you have to do to honor him. Because I know he was such an important person in your life. He definitely helped make you the man you are today. Oh, I'm so very proud of him. I'm sure he would be too. Anyway, I just wanted you to know that. Um, call me back, please, when you get the message. I love you, Jake. Bye, sweetheart. I can't believe that he's gone, dude. Oh, I didn't even, I haven't checked up on my family in months. Listen, that's not your fault, okay? This journey is not your fault. All right? I should the have decisions you made home. during I should have went home and just at least checked up on them. No, listen, that's all right. That's not your fault. You just have to be smarter from now on. This impulsive, impromptu, random decisions that you make, it's gotta stop. You, you can already see it's gonna hurt someone. So, right now, we need to figure out what the next move is. Dude, I should have just went home. You can't go home. Did you just hear a word I said? You're gonna hurt your family. Well, I want, I want at least Ashley, I want Ashley to come back. Listen, I'm already I'm taking care of that. Ashley's coming I'm back. I'm taking care of that. You're done making decisions. Jeff is on his way. All right. Me and him are gonna go go get, get Ashley, Ashley, please, and bring her back here. We're gonna be. Shut the blinds to the windows and don't don't answer the door. Please bring Ashley back. Please. I'm not gonna tell you. Thank you. Come in real quick. Yeah, can we oh, come in? What's going on? Come on in. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Hey, Merry up. Christmas. Ashley? Ashley! Oh, wait, Ashley's not here. What? Ashley's not here. She left this morning before I even got up. Did she well, was, leave by herself or with wait. anybody? By her, I don't know. I was sleeping, but I guess by herself. What, what is going on? Where's Jake? Um. Listen, Ron, we're sorry to interrupt you, but we, we have to. Yeah, we gotta leave. Wait, go. what's going on? No, nothing, nothing, what, nothing. Are nothing. you all panicking? I haven't heard from Jake in like two days. What's uh, going on? It's okay. Okay. It's okay. You're Everything's scaring good. me. No. What are you guys up to? Nothing. We're just we're just helping Jake with something. Yeah. We're bring yeah, we gotta yeah bring... Jake's always up to something, and now I'm scared. 
You no, no need to be scared. Please, guys, do not get my son killed. We're not, no, he, everything's totally fine. Everything's totally fine. Don't. All right, if you see him, tell him to call me because I don't know why he's not. Yeah, we'll try. Yeah, we'll try. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Oh my God. Have a good day. Have yeah, you too. Yeah, Merry you, you too, Paul. Oh, this is not good. Paul. Paul. This is more than not good. My first time at this place since you passed away. Kind of feels uneasy, but feels like you're here next to me, anyways. Jeff, you need to get a hold of I know, of him. I'm trying, Paul. Okay? Dude, you don't understand. Paul! You don't understand. I know perfectly. We need to go now. Paul, how am I supposed to keep trying this when he's not answering the phone? This bridge has all of the fish. Even though we aren't allowed to fish here, we would cast our reel right in that sweet spot. It makes me want to throw up, okay? We need to figure out where he is. You need to figure out where he is. I need to figure you out- You were the last Paul. one he was with! We used to take kayaks out. Down that trail right over there and float down the stream. Nothing else mattered in the world. You mean to tell me you've been friends with him for God knows how long and you don't have the slightest idea where this kid could possibly be? Nothing in the world beats this view over our hometown lake. We could sit here for hours on any given day. You know what? I might have an idea. All right, punch it. We got a little bit of a drive. I lost the man who raised me recently, my mentor, the Jiraiya Sensei of my life. It wasn't the goodbye I was expecting. Actually, I never got to say goodbye at all. I'm a strong believer that loss is necessary in order to gain. Pain teaches the greatest life lessons and that nobody is ever dead as long as you live with their words in your heart. I know life is a bitch and she doesn't fight fair, but I also know you're walking up to heaven on those white stairs. How, how was I stuck chasing my dreams like you pushed me to do? And I woke up from that very dream into a living nightmare. You taught me how to drive, taught me how to cook, taught me how to believe. You taught me all about the necessary tools to overcome any situation that is thrown at me. You taught me how to be the greatest person I could be, but most of all, you taught me how to dream bigger than myself while staying humble to the people around me. I can't wait to get to heaven so you can teach me how to fly too. God, I ask that you forgive Babo for anything he may have done wrong. No one is born evil. No one is born with the intent to hurt others. Unfortunately, as humans, we become a subject to the past events in our lives. Most people become defensive during trauma and want to defend themselves in a survival of the fittest attitude. I get that. When you feel like no one is there with you besides yourself, you start to put yourself first and that's scary. Lord, I ask that you forgive Babo and that you allow him to continue to watch over me from a better view. Allow him to continue to guide me toward the end goals in my life. He raised me to be the best man that I can possibly be. And I pray that you will not judge him for his story, but judge him on the good that he has done and left behind. One day, I will be able to teach millions of kids and inspire millions of kids around the world just how to be happy and successful and loving. I will teach how to follow your dreams and the true meaning of life. I've learned way more than an average 20 year old. And every day, I still continue to learn through your word. Please allow my lost ones to live on through my heart and allow me to carry out any dreams they may have left behind. I will not stop marching forward through the mud, not only for me, but most of all, for the people around me that believe in me. In Jesus' name, I pray, amen. This is all right, let's go. Jeff, is he over here? Jake! 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 Yay! We need to go now. Let's go. Why? Come on. A they took Ashley. We need to go now. Come on. People say money is the root of all evil, but in reality, 
love is. Human instincts and morals become polar opposite when love is in the equation. In order to love, you must risk the bear of hatred. Love breeds hate. When love becomes threatened, we resort to hate. When hatred consumes you, morals become fugazi. No man-made rule even crosses your mind because the power of God and the rule of God towers any moral we learn by man. God bred the human instinct to protect our loved ones without hesitation. Without any thought required, it is instinct. Love is earned and gradually grows like a flower and protected by a lion, by the opposite, hate. I guess life really does work like a yin yang. Wherever there is a lot of love, a little bit of hate is near. Wherever there is a lot of hate, a little bit of love is near. Now this begs me the question for myself. Will my self-inflicted morals control me when I am most vulnerable? Or will my God-given instinct allow me to rip apart anyone who stands in my way to protect the one I love? Thing is clicking or making sense. It's like we're it's like we're missing something completely. This is, this can't be all the evidence, bro. Are we missing something? We are. What? What's he gonna go get? Beats me. 
he's got something. Hopefully something that we can use because this is not working on at all. You've gone too far. Where is Ashley? We need answers now because this is ridiculous. Dude, he's not gonna answer that crap, bro. Listen, I'll do whatever you need me to do. Just give us Ashley back already. This is getting out of hand. Dude, this guy's not gonna answer. Come on, just answer. Come on, I know you're listening. This is literally our, out. our only hope right now. What's up, hey, Jake? Dude, he's not, make him answer. Are you calling him? Mm-hmm. I got scared for a second, I thought he was calling us. Answer the freaking walkie talkie. We need answers and we need them now. Hurry up and respond. This is too far. Dude, give me this freaking walkie talkie. Listen, I'm going to rip your head off if you don't tell me where my fiance is right now. Do you hear me? I have a lot of guns. And I'm going to come blazing at you if you don't tell me what my fiance is. Answer now, you coward. Dude. He's not gonna answer. He's not gonna answer, bro. He's not gonna answer. What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? Jake, listen, I just want to let you know that on this adventure, if you bleed, I bleed. We're in this together. We're brothers. You might make stupid decisions, but we're in this together. Thank you, man. Jake, there's a time in life when a man becomes a man and they grow a pair of nuts. Just want to let you know I'm grabbing my nuts right now. Way to ruin the moment, but okay. Thanks, bro. <laughs> yeah, no problem. Jake, we can't be doing this, bro. It's not only my life you put in danger, but it's also Paul's. Go, Jack. I'm killing you. I got it. But, dude, yeah, do you not understand how selfish this is right I'm now? I'm killing you. Do you not care look about ours? Look at me. You need to pull yourself together. If you keep going straight, you're going to get yourself killed. Do you understand me? And then you're going to get do us killed. Do you understand killed. me? I don't give a shit. All right, well then. Here, not stop me. I'm bashing well, this guy's head screwed. I lost my life. Here. You're gonna take this too. If you're gonna go straight in, I'm gonna be on the side. You call me if anything happens. Do you understand? Okay. Go. Jake. 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 Bro. Bro. Paul has a life you want to live. I have a life that I want to live, dude. We can't keep you doing this. You're gonna keep getting us killed. You are gonna get us killed, dude. Jake, I understand it's Ashley, but this time we need to actually get help. What? Ashley's on the ground! No. 
Stay with Jake. Oh, what is that? Oh, Ashley, 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 wake up. Ashley, wake up. Ashley, wake up. Please, Ashley, wake up. Please, you're not dead. You're not dead. Ashley, please wake up. Please wake up, Ashley. Please wake up. You can't leave me like this. Ashley, please wake up. Please. You can't leave me. You promise me. You promise me you never leave me. You remember that? You promised me that you would never leave me. Please let me go, baby, please. <laughs> you promise you can't. Actually, you need to wake up right now. <laughs> Actually, you need to wake up. First I have left. You can't leave me. Jake, you need to go. What are we gonna do? Check the no, pulse. Sorry. There's a pulse. There's a slight pulse. Jake, get yourself together. Do you understand me? This is a trap. Jake, get yourself together. <laughs> Jeff, try to cut. Get him over away. Get him away. Oh Jake, what Jake, was it? What was go over there. Do, just, I, got I don't it. know. Go over there. Go. Jeff, I need you, you know, car. You, you, yeah. Pick take, her up. Take, go. Take Carry her. Jeff, get him the handle. Yeah. Jake, where are you going? Jake, Jake. Hey, bring your fat ass out here. Jake. Bring your fat ass out here. Right now. Jake. Jake! Bring a fat ass out here! Bro! Jake! This fucking retard! Where are you at? Where are you at? Show yourself! Jake! Show yourself! Why am I doing this? I can't come down this! Come to me! Come to me! Jake! Face to face! Where are you? Jake! Jake! We gotta go! Jake, we found Ashley. We gotta go. Where is he? He's finding Bring her ass out here. Bring her ass out here. Jeff. Go. Go help. Uh, go help bring Ashley to safety. Please, yeah. Jeff. Please. I'm okay. counting on you. All right. Please. Yes, I will. Jake, be careful. I'll be back up with you. I'm killing him. Um. Go, please. I, I help, am. Help Paul and Here, take, you want to take this? Yeah, let's go. Alright.